Hello everyone, welcome back to Tidy Stat YouTube channel. Have you ever struggled about copying and pasting data from another data source into Google Sheets? Or maybe you are wondering how to transpose the data from rows to column or column to rows when transposing seamlessly? Well, in this case, let me show you how to use copying and pasting feature in Google Sheets so you will understand how to use these tricks properly. Okay, you might agree with me that Microsoft Excel is the most favorite data application that people use in the world. Whether they are a student or they are a manager or even a mom, they can use Excel properly. Well, the first thing that you need to understand to import and paste data in Google Sheets is about importing file from Microsoft Excel. So to do this, go to file and then select import. So. Google Sheets will offer you several options so we can import our data here and then select upload if we store it in uh, your storage or if you store it online you can use my drive or share with me options and then click browse or you can also drag the file to the dialog box but in this case let me just browse and select the file here I choose the satisfaction survey and click open wait for a little bit so uh, Google Sheets will import your data and after that uh, For the import location you can choose whether to create a new spreadsheet Insert a new sheet or replace the existing spreadsheet. I'll just leave it by default and then click import data After that your Excel file will be imported into Google Sheets properly Okay, sorry. I want to click open now great your Excel file is already imported into Google Sheets and you see here and let me open the Microsoft Excel original file and you see it's correctly imported okay and actually there is another method that you can use to import this data you don't have to import this by the whole file you can also select the specific range of the data and copy it from Microsoft Excel and paste it into Google Sheets. To do this, select the range of the data in Microsoft Excel that you want to copy here. Let me show it to you. Okay. After that, press Ctrl C or you can do this by doing the right click and then select copy. After that, go to Microsoft, oh sorry, go to Google Sheets application. Let me open a new sheet here. And then select the location let me paste it into cell a3 right click and then select paste or you can do this also by typing ctrl v great now your excel data is successfully imported into google sheets application google sheets also allow us to copy data from notepad in case you are saving your data in notepad format so here let me maximize the display of google sheets and open my notepad file and then here i prepare two data two simple data uh, one is separated by tab and the second one is separated by space let's see what happened when we copy this data into google sheets first let's copy the data separated by tab which means the john and fab uh, data this is separated by tab like this and let's copy these two rows press ctrl c and after that select the location at the google sheet right click and then click paste see your data is successfully imported into google sheets in a tidy view see here the data is placed in the right column and the right cell and what if we copy the data that is separated by space let me show you this data is separated by space yes. okay sorry great now let me copy this press ctrl c and then open the google sheets and then right click select paste see here it's not tidy at all and it's not comfortable to see so if you are copy the data from notepad make sure to give a space or 
uh, tidy the data by using the tab function, not by space or comma or so on. And sometimes we form the data in the row formatted and we want to transpose it into the column formatted or vice versa. The question is how to do this? Well, let me show you. Let me delete this to row so we have a better vision. And see here, Jan, Feb, and March, or the month is in row format, and the data is also in the row format. And let's transpose this data. Select the data here, and then right click. After the select copy, and then click the area where you want to paste the data, and then right click there, and then click, sorry, select paste special, and then click transpose here the option great now you see that the month heading that we have is already transposed into the column formatted okay if you are working with large data set that is in row formatted this feature is really helpful the last thing i want to show you is that you can also copy data from a specific page or website into google sheets easily to do this Let's open a website that contains data. Let me type Robert Downey Jr. film here in Wikipedia. And this page contains the list of the films starring by Robert Downey Jr. here. And then we will copy this table into Google Sheets. Go to the bottom right of the table, click it, and then hold it into the whole table to the top. And make sure to include the heading of the table to the top left of the table. Okay, great. And then right click. After that, click copy. And let's get back to the Google Sheets application. And let me copy this into a new sheet. Select the location where you want to paste the data. Right click and then click paste. Great. Now you are successfully uh, copying a data from a specific page or website into Google Sheets application. And you can also adjust or resize the uh, cells here by double clicking on the column delimiter. And another thing is the text in this uh, cell contains the link. So when you click it, you will move into a Wikipedia page. And to avoid this type of uh, data, you can also copy the text only to do this right click in the cells and then click paste specials and then click values only so google sheets will not include the links in the text here this is the only text that you copy from the wikipedia and it is without links okay i think that's all you need to understand about copying and pasting data from excel or another data source into both sheets and see you in another video.